An alert tonight for people on and around the Georgia Tech campus. Yeah, police are on the lookout for a man who officers say jumped and pistol whipped a man right near the student union. Now, Fox News' Doug Evans joins us live from Georgia Tech. And at this point, Doug, do police have any leads? They have a few leads, a description of two people, also the description of a car, a newer model Nissan Sentra. Tom and Snay were told that police are keeping a close watch on First Street near the Student Center tonight. The latest robbery on Georgia Tech, an actual attack. It happened on First Street near the Student Center. It has people on edge. Students? A guy got pistol whipped here last night, got hit over the head with a gun. Wow. What, what do you think about that? Well, I mean, it's a very, very terrible thing. It's, uh, yeah, it's so sad and very terrible. I don't, I don't wish anybody around me experienced something like that. And staff. It's very disconcerting that somebody's on campus and hiding out in the bushes and waiting for people who are not paying attention to, you know, go home. According to Georgia Tech, the victim was not a student. It happened around 9.30 on Wednesday night. He was walking on First Street when he says a man jumped from the bushes and pistol whipped him. When he fell to the ground, a second man crossed the street and took his backpack, wallet, and cell phone. The two men ran off down First Street toward Cherry Street. I try to be attentive. I try to not travel by myself when I can, and I try to make sure that I'm looking at my surroundings, which is very important nowadays. We talked tonight about how people are staying safe on the Tech campus. Most of the students are home for the holidays now. These two electrical engineering students from Nigeria say they usually walk in pairs and take the campus shuttle. One, we make sure we walk in pairs, and two, we stay. We don't stay late outside at night, and uh, we also use some of the stingray the shuttles that are provided for night movement. We're told after the robbery Wednesday the night Georgia Tech worked on a surveillance camera on First Street. We found mobile cameras also on First Street near the scene of the crime. We've seen a lot of Georgia Tech patrol cars here on First Street tonight. That's got to be reassuring to the students that are still left here on campus. Most of the students, as we said, have gone home for the holidays. Live on the Georgia Tech campus, Doug Evans, Fox 5 News. All right, thanks, Doug.